Hello everybody. So today I wanted to make a quick video on why I haven't been very active lately and if all those modding projects for both Easy Raid 2 and Operation Harsh Door Stop are still going to be made. The short answer is yes, they are. The long answer is the rest of this video. But, but first I would like to make a quick announcement. I now have a PayPal me link. I want to make this clear that this is just if you want to support my work and that you obviously don't have to donate any money to me. Your money, your choice, as always. With that out of the way, first I want to talk about why, I, why I've, I've been absent for so long. And the answer is pretty simple. I was busy with a bunch of real life stuff. I was also busy with high school. It's really that simple. But now that it's summer, I have plenty of free time to, go to work on my mods. First I want to talk about how this will go. My plan is to finish as much Easy Reds 2 stuff as possible before the end of the summer. And maybe if I have some time left, I will do some mods for Operation or Harsh Door Stop 2. That's a big maybe. So for Easy Raid 2, the first campaign I will, I will be releasing is most likely going to be 4. Because it's almost done, I just need to make a few more bonus missions and test it a bit more. I was originally going to add more to the map, but if I do, the PC of anybody who plays that map will probably explode and I don't want that. The next one would probably be Utsberg, Utsbeek, which is part of the Project Market Garden, which was originally supposed to be main game, a main game campaign, but because the project started so long ago, and the person helping make the project sort of just disappeared, they were the one in contact with Marco too, the developer of the game, so I don't really ha know, and I'm going to need to rediscuss if, if it being main game is still an option. Next would be Pacific Storm, which is a campaign inspired by the map from Battlefield 5 called Pacific Storm. The campaign would, is going to have an estimate of 32 missions, and it's already about halfway done. And these two last ones are going to be harder to finish on time. It's the Fall of Tobruk, a remastered campaign, which is an old map I made with a friend. And the other one is the Vegel rework, which is also for Project Market Garden. They both have little work done on them and they're a pretty big map and both need some kind of major change in their structural layout so I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to, f to finish them on time. Now for OHT. Ever since the 0.13 major update, there was a lot of mods that I need to remake because they don't work with the new features. The first one that I will be releasing is the US and German Snow Faction along with the Snowy Oregon map. Most of that is already done, it should be pretty easy to finish, I was just testing some more, a couple of features to make the mod more unique and I just need to finish adding them. I also plan on remaking the modern German faction, so I'm gonna add a couple new weapons, update the models, add some more variety and new features, just make the mod generally better and more unique. And finally, one last announcement. I started working on my own game, which is still in early stages, and will take a few years to make. But as I am getting more and more people to help me with it and more stuff done on it, I will possibly start showing some like sneak peeks about it on the channel talking about it, so stay tuned for that. And with that being said, this is the end of the video. Hope these cleared a couple of things and hope you guys enjoyed the mod I released this summer.